Forecast with Mike Linden and First Alert Defender. Waking up to some cool temperatures as we get started this morning with temperatures expected to feel even cooler than what the thermometer indicates. Right now in Lexington, starting to see that beautiful sunrise along the horizon. But notice that there's just not as much cloud cover this morning as where we were yesterday. So that just makes it feel that much cooler. 43 degrees right now, but with the winds, could feel a little bit cooler than that as we head into the rest of your morning, especially so overnight tonight. But we'll take a look. At that in just a moment. Right now, live first alert defender not picking up much rainfall early on this morning. Quite a difference to what it looked like 24 hours ago at this time, as that cold front brought us some pretty widespread wet weather and cloud cover. But that's pushing off to the northeast of us. You can see that that front now beginning to work its way past Detroit and toward Buffalo, New York, picking up a lot of moisture over the Great Lakes as well. Now, what's left over for Kentucky are cool, cool temperatures in the wake of that passing cold front. Cool enough. Enough that in some spots we're actually seeing some frost warnings. Not for Kentucky, but a frost advisory in place for Nashville, Tennessee, and a freeze watch in effect for spots in Virginia. This is what we can expect as we head into tomorrow morning for Kentucky as things cool down that much more. But right now, boy, it is cold out there. Danville picking up 39 degree temperatures early on, and a few spots pretty close to that. Fort Knox 40, Frankfurt 40 degrees as well. Lexington, one of the warmer spots this morning at 43 degrees. And again, with the winds this morning gusting up throughout our day today, right now at about 20 miles per hour in Covington, things will feel a little bit cooler than that. So let's take you hour by hour so you can see what you can expect out of how it will feel outside today. Nonetheless, what you should take away from this is that you should grab a jacket before you head outside because look at this, 7 o'clock this evening, this is just before we hit our highs for the day in the mid 50s. 40 degrees is what it will feel like in Lexington, and that's pretty close to where it is right now this morning. And remember, kickoff for the Wildcats at Commonwealth, 7.30 this evening, so don't leave that jacket at home. It will certainly be football weather. This is tomorrow morning. The mid-20s, sub-freezing, at least that's what it will feel like tomorrow morning and into tomorrow afternoon, right back into the mid-50s. So if you're heading to Commonwealth this evening, kick off 730. That's 49 degrees for you out there. So don't leave that jacket at home, a hat, maybe even the gloves. At least put them in the pockets of your jacket. Certainly couldn't hurt and shouldn't take up that much room. So your high temperature today, right around 55 degrees. It will be a little less cloudy today than where we were yesterday, so you should still see some sun. Sunshine, a great day to head out to Keeneland and check out some of those races. And certainly not as wet. Still a chance for some wraparound moisture as that low pushes off to the east of us, or that cold front rather. So you could still see some wet weather today, but certainly not as much as yesterday. The rest of your weekend still looks quite cool, especially so overnight with lows near freezing. And then as we kick off the work week next week, the rain returns. Could even see some thunderstorms as we push into Tuesday.